I've got arthritis, and uh, it's fine. I'm on I'm on medication. Um, I'm on meth. Any anyone else on meth? Methotrexate. That's the one that I'm on. Um, methotrexate. That's the one that they use in chemotherapy. But um, I, I'm just microdosing. Um, but uh, before I started taking it, my doctor said, uh, just so you know, you, you have to lower your alcohol intake when you take this. So you're only allowed to have two to three standard drinks a week. And I was like, oh, that's fine. Yeah, that, that's about what I have anyway. So yeah, no problem. <laughs> yeah, it, was, it wasn't until the next day <laughs> that I was like, hang on a second. There's seven days in a week. <laughs> Two to three standard drinks a week? I can't do... What if I stuff up when I have the two to three? Two to three... I can't... Do you know what? You don't tell me what to do. You don't tell me how much I can drink. I'm going to decide how much I'm going to drink. That's up to me. I'm going to decide and I'm going to have zero. That's right, zero alcohol for me. I'm going to be sober. Yeah, I'm going to be... So and here's the thing. I know. I know I can go the other way. Yeah, I know. I could spend maybe ten minutes online and I would find a blog or Reddit comment just going, you can drink as much as you want. I'm aware, right? <laughs> But here's the thing, I inherently trust the advice of medical professionals, yeah? <laughs> like, for example, if I was an elite athlete, yeah, and I was given what I was told was vitamin supplements, <laughs> I would ask no further questions. <laughs> and I would just be thankful for my enhanced performance, yeah? <laughs> That's good. So, so, so I'm sober now. Like it's been, it's been about nine months, and um, you know what? It's it's good. It's it's fine. It's it's not. It's the fucking worst. I hate it. I hate it so much. Here's the thing. You got to remember, I didn't quit drinking because I had a problem with it. Yeah, I was really fucking good at it. I loved alcohol. I appreciated. I savoured every moment of it. Yeah. But now, now I'll go out, and I, you know, people go, "Oh, can I get you a drink?" And I go, "Oh, no, thank you. I'm sober." And they go, "Oh, congratulations." No, not congratulations. Commiserations. Yeah. And then they go, "Oh, but you're looking really good. You're looking really good." I'm like, "I already looked good." Yeah. You know the worst place to be sober? Worst place to be sober is at a wedding because you can't leave. You can't leave a wedding, yeah? You've got to stick around. Guess it's like 9 o'clock and everyone's like, it's murder. Ooh, we're on the dance floor. And you're like, oh, get me out. And then you'll go to the bar and you're like, hello, um, do you have any of those non-alcoholic drinks? Like, do you have a non-alcoholic beer or wine or something? And they'll go, yeah, we've got Great Northern Zero. Great Northern? Great Northern? I think that it's the shittest tasting beer and you've just made it even worse by putting zero alcohol in it. Yeah. yeah? What about a mocktail? Do you do any mocktails? And they'll go, no, we just do cocktails, not mocktails, just cocktails. What? Make a mocktail. Make it, sorry, but if you're an establishment that has a drinks menu, and on that drinks menu there's a non-alcoholic section, but the only thing there is a shitty non-alcoholic beer, I'm sorry, but you deserve another lockdown. Yeah? <laughs> Make a mocktail. Make a, put in some effort, though. Don't just get juice and cordial and slide that over to me. Like, get some ice, get something fizzy, get some juice, get some syrup, blend it, shake it, build it over. Like, just put it in a nice... Like, put in some fucking effort. Like, I'll pay, I'll pay $15 for that. Do you know? I'll pay $15 if you put in... Do you know how much juice costs? Do you know how much juice costs? Me neither. But imagine the fucking markup on that. Just make a fucking mocktail. How fucking hard... Make fucking mocktails. Sorry. Um... I am grieving and um, <laughs> might be at the anger stage <laughs> of grief. Um, or maybe I have taken the other kind of meth. <laughs> I've been Johnny Hickey. Thanks very much, Legend.